There was an additional stop that Vance made at a home in Oklahoma City after the murders in Luther. I arrived at 4.30 uh, on Thursday and the cops wouldn't let me get to my mother-in-law's house because she takes care of my kids. So I couldn't get here and I was like, what's going on? What's going on? They're like, no, we can't. You can't get to their house and they can't leave the house because there's a bad man here and we're like, well, no, we need to get the kids. So what they did is they escorted my mother-in-law with the kids to where I was at. Later I come to find out that it was a bad man that killed a lot of people and he was living next door to my mother-in-law's house. Uh, how do you feel about that, that he was staying somewhere right there? Very bad. How could they do that? How could somebody let him just be so close to where well, there's a bunch of kids here? I don't feel very good about that. Based upon great law enforcement work, Danny Roach of Oklahoma City was identified as having come in contact with Vance immediately after the murders in Luther. On October the 28th, law enforcement officers interviewed Roach about him having seen Vance immediately after the homicides occurred. Based upon all of the information that was acquired during the investigation and the interview, Roach was arrested and booked into the Oklahoma County Jail early Saturday morning.